The Great Hornbill's Flight of Discovery. Please subscribe. So you don't miss a new story. In the heart of a lush and ancient rainforest, nestled high in the treetops, there lived a magnificent great hornbill named Hari. Hari's striking appearance was a testament to his regal nature, with his enormous curved beak, vibrant plumage, and the resounding trumpet-like call that echoed through the jungle each morning. However, Hari was more than just a majestic bird, he was known for his curiosity and a relentless desire to explore the world beyond the forest canopy. The Forbidden Valley As Hari ventured deeper into the Forbidden Valley, the challenges grew more daunting. Jagged cliffs towered above, casting menacing shadows, and powerful gusts of wind threatened to toss him from the sky. Predators, their eyes gleaming with hunger, lurked in the dense undergrowth. Hari's vibrant plumage and melodious call, which had once filled the forest with his presence, now seemed like a beacon announcing his presence to every lurking danger. Despite the odds stacked against him, Hari pressed onward, driven by an insatiable curiosity and the belief that there must be something extraordinary hidden within the valley. He encountered creatures he had never seen before, strange, iridescent insects that illuminated the darkest corners, and radiant flowers that emitted a soothing fragrance, unlike anything in the outside world. One day, while navigating a treacherous ravine, Hari came across a beautiful waterfall, its crystalline waters cascading from the cliffs above. As he approached, he noticed an old, wise turtle basking on a sun-warmed rock near the falls. The turtle introduced himself as Taro and spoke of the valley's history. Taro explained that the Forbidden Valley was once a place of great serenity and beauty, but as time passed, fear and mistrust had turned it into a land of danger and isolation. Taro shared stories of its lost wonders, majestic trees that reached the heavens, shimmering caves adorned with precious gems, and a hidden glade where the first rays of dawn kissed the earth. Hari realized that his journey was not just about conquering adversity, it was about rediscovering the lost beauty of the Forbidden Valley. With Taro's guidance, he began to restore harmony to the valley, planting new trees, nurturing the rare and endangered plants, and creating a sanctuary for the creatures who had been isolated for so long. Over time, the valley transformed. It regained its former glory, its lushness and serenity returning. The once dangerous predators became protectors, guarding the valley and its newfound beauty. Eventually, Hari made the arduous journey back to his home in the rainforest, forever changed by his experiences. His journey through the Forbidden Valley had not only tested his resilience but also rekindled the valley's spirit and brought back its lost wonders. The Nest of Dreams As Leela embarked on her quest to build the most beautiful nest the forest had ever seen, she faced a series of challenges and setbacks. Each day, she worked tirelessly, collecting twigs, leaves, and feathers, but no matter how hard she tried, she couldn't find the perfect materials to match her vision. One morning, as Leela was collecting twigs deep in the forest, she stumbled upon an injured bird. It was a young, colorful parrot named Perry, who had fallen from its nest. Leela, with her kind heart, couldn't leave the parrot to fend for itself, so she nursed it back to health and made a new friend in the process. Perry, grateful for Leela's kindness, shared her own story of struggle. She had always dreamed of flying higher and farther than any other bird in the forest, but a damaged wing had kept her grounded. Inspired by Leela's unwavering determination to build the perfect nest, Perry decided to help. Together, Leela and Perry scoured the forest for materials. Perry used her sharp beak to collect colorful petals and shiny leaves from the treetops, while Leela contributed her collection of twigs and feathers. They worked tirelessly, using their unique abilities to create a nest that was both strong and stunningly beautiful. The other forest creatures watched in amazement as the nest took shape. It seemed like a work of art, a testament to the power of collaboration and determination. Leela and Perry's partnership was a symbol of the idea that when individuals come together, each contributing their unique strengths, they can achieve greatness. Finally, the nest was completed. It was not only beautiful but also a testament to the deep friendship and shared dreams of its creators. As Leela and Perry perched together in their masterpiece, they felt a sense of accomplishment and contentment that surpassed their wildest expectations. The forest creatures celebrated their achievement, and Leela and Perry's story became an enduring legend, inspiring others to work together and overcome obstacles. It was a reminder that even in the face of adversity, friendship, determination, and the willingness to help others can lead to the realization of our dreams. Ending As Leela and Perry perched together in their masterpiece, a sense of serenity enveloped them. The forest creatures gathered around, marveling at the beautiful nest and the heartwarming story behind it. 
Birds from all corners of the rainforest came to see the nest of dreams, and it quickly became a symbol of unity and determination. Word of Leela and Perry's achievement spread far and wide, reaching even the distant corners of the forest. Birds and animals who had once been divided by fear or mistrust were now drawn together by the tale of the extraordinary nest and the friendship that had created it. The rainforest began to change, as creatures from different species started collaborating, sharing resources, and helping each other. The once isolated creatures of the rainforest found inspiration in Leela and Perry's story. They realized that they too could achieve greatness by working together. The forest buzzed with activity as various animals started working on their own dreams and projects, whether it was building new homes, creating beautiful gardens, or solving long-standing disputes peacefully. As the rainforest transformed, it grew even more vibrant and diverse. The different species learned to appreciate each other's unique qualities and contributions. Friendships formed across species boundaries, and the forest became a harmonious community. Leela and Perry's nest, now known as the Nest of Unity, stood as a symbol of what could be achieved when individuals put aside their differences and worked together. It wasn't just a beautiful nest, it was a testament to the power of collaboration and determination. Hari, who had returned from his own adventure in the Forbidden Valley, was amazed by the change he saw in the rainforest. The forest he had left behind had become a place of unity, where creatures of all kinds lived in harmony. He realized that, just like the Forbidden Valley, the rainforest had transformed because of the efforts and determination of its inhabitants. The rainforest, once again thriving and full of life, served as a metaphor for the broader world. It showed that when individuals come together, when they celebrate each other's differences and work toward common goals, they can create a better, more beautiful world for everyone. The moral is that unity and cooperation can bring about positive change and transform even the most challenging and divided environments. Leela and Perry's story not only inspired those in the rainforest but also serves as a reminder for all of us to embrace collaboration, celebrate diversity, and work together to build a brighter future. Just as the rainforest flourished when its inhabitants joined forces, our world can thrive when we come together in unity and harmony. The End Don't forget to subscribe.